pull up on me. Don't play with me. Hey y'all, what's up? We back, back with another video. But first of all, what is this? And why did you walk around looking like this? That's no, 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 no. But don't worry about it. We're going to get it together. So today's video is a wig and video. So let's get into it. So today I'm going to be using all Ebon products. So right here, I'm using my Ebon Braid Formula Super Hold Gel. Um, I know we use it for braids, but I like to use it for edge control and to slick back my ponytails when I do like a slick back. So here you see me just getting a little bit. And when I say a little bit, I really mean a little bit. This stuff is heavy and it will turn your hair white if you use too much. But you just see me spreading it on my head and on the front of my hair mainly. So we can slick it back to put on our wig cap. So I'm going to go ahead and get my 1999 brushing your eyebrow brush that your mom used to use when she used to do your hair in the morning for school. But you just see me brushing my hair back so that when I put the wig cap on, um, the glue and stuff doesn't, you know, get on my edges. And when I get ready to pull the wig off to take off my edges but here you see me using my ebon wonder lace bun adhesive spray and this is the supreme hold when i say supreme this stuff will have your edges and everything laid slayed and stuck so now i'm taking my broke well it ain't broke yet but i broke it in, in like in the middle of this video but i'm taking my small tooth comb and slicking it back so everything can be flat once you put on that wig cap. So now I'm fighting with blow dryer. You're trying to get it so that we can go ahead and blow dry this spray. So we can put our wig cap on. So here we using the devil's breath to go ahead and dry this uh, spray in our head. Y'all, I don't believe, I'm not going to say I don't believe in using cool, the cool setting on the blow dryer. But... I just feel like it takes too long. So we're just going to use the, the devil's breath today. So as you can see, I'm burning my brain cells, burning all the skin off my face because what? But anyways, we're going to go ahead and get our wig cap, a new one. But why does wig cap want to try me? Like, come on, you, you messing up my video. Get off. Anyway, why did I throw that like that? Like, girl, be for real. But you see me right here fighting with the wig cap because of my nails. But it doesn't matter. But we're going to get into it. Oh, and by the way, nails by Nike. Nike did it. Yep, she sure did. I'm going to put her stuff in the, in the um, description box too. And I'm also going to uh, link all the products I use in this video as well. Now, why did that Chinese lady sell me this little bitty wig cap? Like, girl, you see my hair the size of a rock? You could have gave me the biggest wig cap y'all had. Come on, some one size fit up. Nah, this cap is for a baby. I need Mega Minds wig cap. But anyways, y'all see me putting my wig cap on and pulling it down right above my eyebrows. Y'all need to stop pulling this eye these wig caps down below your eyebrows. This is not too shiesty. We're not putting on a shiesty mask. But anyways. You see me going back in with my Ebon Wonder Lace Bun Spray and just spraying it around the perimeters of the wig cap to lay it down. Because without a flat wig cap, your wig is not going to be flat or your wig is not going to lay right. And it's not going to hide your lace. Because when we put on our wigs, we need to say what lace. We need to be able to play uh, Where's Waldo with our lace. But you see me taking the end of my comb and just spraying the spray out over the wig cap so that the wig cap can melt properly so i forgot to cut my ear holes out so now i'm about to do that because why would, how could you forget that part so now i'm just gonna take some random hair shears that i had in the bathroom and use them to cut my ear holes out because i forgot this step. that should have been the first thing i did when i put my wig cap on but we're gonna go ahead and cut this ear hole out I feel like my ears are big. I don't know. People tell me I have average size ears, but I feel like my ears are big. Um, and we're going to cut this other ear hole out because we need it out. But if y'all hear that dog in the background, that's my neighbor dog. I do apologize. He don't want me to be great in this video today, but we're going to keep it pushing. So 
I'm going ahead and pulling my ears out of the wig cap. And now I'm going to go back in with my ebon spray and spray right there by the ear holes so that that can lay down as well because I don't want that part lifted. There's been times where I had my wig going and that part lifted and just say I tried to pull my hair in a ponytail and just because that part wasn't, you know, laid down, my wig came up. So now we taking the devil's breath again and drying that spray and spray. Drying that spray in place so that we can uh melt our wig cap. Um I was fighting for my life in this part too because that blow dryer was burning my ears. And as you probably can see me holding my ear back to where it don't burn me. And um some of them the wig the part the flaps by my ear. I didn't have enough spray on it, so I'm going to have to go in and put some more spray right there because, and that part too, like, look at it. I had to tap it to see if it was dry, and look what it did. <laughs> it created a gap, so now I'm going to have to put some more wig spray on it to lay that part down, but we're going to go ahead and keep drying this so we can go ahead and cut our lace, and yeah, look at it. Like, that look like Casper the Ghost, so... Let's spray some more spray right there. But this is going to take too long. So I'll be back when it's time to cut the lace off. All right. So we back. And now I have my eyebrow razor, shaver, cutter, dicer, slicer. And we're going to go ahead and cut the excess cap off to... Because we don't need it. Like, we don't need it. So as you can see, I'm, I like to use this part of the wig cap and just pull it back above, like above my hairline i don't know why i do that but i seen a girl do that in tiktok off a tiktok video and it to me it makes the wig cap tighter i don't know how but hey look any tips i can use i'm gonna use them so you just see me cutting this part um off that way i can um pull it back and watch me cut a piece of my sideburn off like Y'all, I was so upset. Watch my face, y'all. Just watch it. Like, gone. <laughs> Look, my scissors went cut. But now I just pull this part back. Um, and I'm trying to cut a piece of this off. I didn't know it was stuck. I didn't know my sideburn was stuck right there. Um, but you going to see me. <laughs> y'all, watch my face. When I realized I cut my hair, I wanted to cry so bad. Like, then my, the back part of this wig cap was not laid down. Like, it was so much going on in this video. Like, look, girl, I didn't have no needle and thread to sew it down. So, we had to make do what it do. And the Edmund Spray going to get you right. So, that's what I used. And I don't know why I didn't think about that. Because that blow dryer was burning my neck. Like, the back of my neck was on fire. The back of my neck is probably burnt by now. Because, girl, when I told y'all... My blow dryer is made of the devil's breath. Like, y'all think I be playing when I call it the devil's breath. That blow dryer is hot. Like, girl, who made it? But, anyways, we're going to continue to blow dry that and let that lay down. And let's just get into it. It was too hot, so I had to come back to the front. So, we done with the blow drying part. So, now we're going to go ahead and cut off the excess um, wig cap that we didn't cut off before so i'm back with my slicer dicer going ahead and cut that part off um and right here is where i cut my sideburn but i didn't realize it until i looked at my hands right here hair like i was i was upset i wanted to cry um and i i really didn't care to be honest because hair is hair is going to grow back but I wanted to cry so bad because I just cut my I cut my hair. Like, girl, how do you cut your hair? But anyways, um, let's go ahead and continue to cut this lace off. I nipped myself right here and I tried to play like I didn't do it. But, you know, it was thinking. But we just going to keep our, <laughs> our resting face and act like our forehead is not on fire. Because, girl, my forehead was burning. When I say burning... 
it was burnt. But, um, yeah, we're going to try not to cut ourselves again because I already cut my sideburn off. Then I just cut my forehead. Like, what? So, y'all, look at this piece right here. What? Get get off. Now I have to fight with this piece because I had the, the spray on my hand. My hands were sticky. I couldn't grip it. Like, girl, what is going on? Get your life together. Get it. Get it together. Anyways. So, look at me fighting with it. Like, I had to rub. I didn't even stab myself trying to get it off. Like, girl, look at me. Jabbing myself in the forehead. About to stab a hole in my forehead. Trying to get it off. But, um, yeah. We're going to go ahead and fix that. Get it off. And... I just got aggravated because why? Why? Um, I'm just going to slice a piece of my forehead off. It'll be all fine. It'll, my, my forehead will come back. But um, we're just going to slice and dice to get that part off. Like, I was so aggravated in this video. Like, it didn't make no type of sense. But going back in with the infamous spray, or no, I lied. We're going back in with... Not back in, but we're going in with our foundation and we're just going to spread it on the uh, wig cap so that it can um it can blend in with our hair so we can look like some eggheads. So I kind of went a little bit too crazy with the foundation um on my forehead, but it's going to be okay. I still like an egghead. I look like Lil Bill. See? Look. Where my hair go? Where my hair? I'm about to hit it. Wig cap is melted. And I didn't even, like, I didn't even use the spray it. But you can see I went a little overboard with it. But it's going to be okay because it's going to be under the wig. And ain't nobody going to see it unless I take my wig off. But we just fixing the body ear holes and stuff. And, like, look, it is blending in with my skin perfectly. Like, wig cap wear until I, like, bend my head down. But we're not going to talk about it. Not too much on me. But... Who child while I'm out of breath. But um now I gotta cut a, another piece off because it was stuck to my ear. So we're gonna go ahead and slice that part off and slice the chunk of our ear off because that razor was sharp. So we just making sure everything is right. So why am I wiping stuff off like it was hair some up there right there? This is the face you make when you realize your camera died and you just up there recording. But Anyways, we're going to get into it, though. So now I'm using my Edben, um Wonder Lace Bun Glue. And that's the active um, glue. So, like, when you sweat and stuff, it does not come up. It That will that will hold your wig until eternity. But right here, I'm fighting with it because it would not come out. Like, then it spit on me. Like, girl, why would you even do that? Why would you do that? But I'm using the end of my razor. And spreading it out so um that it can dry properly because if you have a thick clunk of glue on your head it's not gonna dry quick it's not i'm telling you it's not gonna dry i learned the, the hard way but i'm just spreading the glue out on my um wig cap so that i can spread the layer of glue out so that i can dry it and put it on my wig so now I'm I'm dropping stuff. <laughs> so now I'm taking my razor and spreading it out. When I say it has to be thin, it has to be thin. That's why when y'all be like when y'all put on a thick layer of glue and y'all spread it out and it takes forever for it to turn clear, it's because y'all still have glue on top of that layer trying to dry and it's gonna take forever to dry. So use thin layers. Um, with this glue, you do not have to use three and four layers. When I tell y'all, this glue is like bubble gum that you don't stuck up under the desk, baby. This glue is this glue is stuck. Okay, it's stuck. So we're gonna go ahead and let that go ahead and spread that out. I wish this dog would shut up because he is getting on my everlasting nerves. But we ain't gonna talk about it. We're just gonna deal with it and keep this video rolling. So. Y'all, this is so time consuming. Like, 
I'm getting glue everywhere. I didn't put enough glue on this side. Like, girl, get your life together. Get it together and get it together fast. So, I'm going to go ahead and put some more. Like, I don't really have to fight with this glue tube. And then I just touched the glue with my arm. I'm um, trying to put it up there. So, we just going to put some more glue right here. A lot came out. So, we're just going to have to use that and just distribute it on our hairline and spread it out. Because we're not wasting no glue, honey. So, we're just going to spread that out and um, make sure our layer of glue is um, spread it out evenly. You can see how it is already turning um, clear because it's already it was thin. So, I didn't use a, quick, a thick hunk of glue. So, we're just going to go ahead and spread that out. And I'll be back when I get the glue and stuff. Um, straight but you see me fanning you see me fanning but I'll be back cause this is too much like girl what are you doing what are you doing why are you dancing yeah we caught you but I'll be back alright so we, why did I do that so we back and we're gonna apply our wig and this is a I wanna say a 16 inch body wave wig and I got this wig from I believe love me I believe it would love me. But I'm going to go ahead and put this wig on my head so we can go ahead and lay it down. Don't talk about my ponytail in the back because I didn't feel like braiding my hair down. I already had a slick back, so I just had to refresh the slick back so I could put the wig on. But look at me fighting to put this wig on my head. Like, girl, what are you doing? But, yeah, though I don't know why I could not get the lace to unfold but like the the lace was folding and i didn't like that so look at me i'm <laughs> i literally have to sit here and fight with this wig to get it like i'm pulling the lace so freaking tight to get it to lay down like i could not get it right but like it was the lace was literally rolling under the wig and it i wasn't having it like Look at my face. I was so... Look. I was aggravated. Like, I could not get the wig to act right. Like, girl. Like, look at it. <laughs> it would not act right for me. And y'all can see the... Look. Look at my forehead. I'm still bleeding from when I cut myself earlier. Trying to cut the wig cap. But it's okay. But I'm trying to lay this wig down. And it will not cooperate with me. Like, girl. Please help me. Please. But now I'm taking my comb. This is another comb because I brought the pink one from earlier. Um, So I'm trying to work in sections because that lace was giving me a hard time. Like you see it. Like you can see it pulling. It's folding. But I'm trying to work in sections. I should have applied the glue in sections because it was not. It was not helping me. Look at it. Like girl, why are you folding? Stop. I was getting so aggravated, but I was trying not to let it show on my face. But I was, ugh, I could not do it. I was so upset, y'all. I had to get off camera. I had to get off camera. But, girl, I had to go in the other mirror to get this this lace right. Because, why? Why are you treating me like this? Like, y'all, I'm sorry I'm off camera so much. But I had to get it right. It wouldn't. It wouldn't work with me. So now I'm just pressing this part down. Because this is the only part that will work. And I was having a hard time. Like, my glue was starting to dry. The lace was still rolling up on this side. Look at it. You can see it pulling the hair down. The hair cream, the line on my forehead. Girl. I was, I was having a hard time. Like, I, the comb wasn't working. So I'm trying to unroll it with my finger. And press it down. And... It wouldn't unroll. Like, I don't know why the wig was rolling up. Like, it was... Mm -mm. My wig was turning into a Swiss roll. I, I couldn't... I couldn't do it. I, I would look at it. Look look at my forehead, y'all. Like, why? Why are you doing this to me? But... Yeah. I was... I was screaming in my head. Like, if y'all could hear my inner thoughts, I was screaming. Like... <sighs> aggravation at its finest but we're gonna push through because i wasn't gonna stop this video like 
I was so I was so upset. Like <laughs> I wanted to give up. I really wanted to give up, y'all. Like, look. I was so, look, girl, like, what is that? Like, and it's still rolling up, y'all. I wanted to cry. I really wanted to cry. Like, but we're going to end up getting together. Like, girl, where are you going? Like, where are you going? Where are you going? Like, I was so mad. And I I ended up breaking my comb trying to use the rat tail and unroll the week. So, yeah. I gave up. <laughs> but I'm back. And... I finally ended up getting it to stop unrolling, and now look at my glue. It is my glue had dried, and while I was trying to get it to um get the lace to unroll, so that's why you see that white part. Yeah, but I'm gonna end up fixing it because I didn't like that. So we just don't stop about to cry, like about to cry, cause what is that? <laughs> Girl, I was having the hardest time with this wig. Like, I had to end up cutting lace off of it, the part that rolled off. I had to cut some of that off because it was too noticeable. And this wig was one of them wigs was like, you can't say it with lace because, baby, lace everywhere. <laughs> um, So I ended up having to pull it back and readjust it. And it was just nerve-wracking. But we're going to end up getting together because this wig will not defeat me. But you can see me just patiently. When I say I have so much patience, I had to learn. You got to be patient because I would have been gave up on this wig. So I'm just trying my best to go ahead and fix it. So I'll be back when I finally fix it. I will be back because this is too much for me, y'all. Hey y'all, so I'm back. So now I'm going to go with my Ebon Wonder Bun Lace Melting Spray. And we're just going to go ahead and um, spray it on our lace. And we're just going to melt that lace. So I've never seen this before. Um, I actually seen it and I'm like, let me try that. So we're just going to go ahead and spray this on our lace. Y'all, when I say, when y'all spray this, y'all better be ready to catch this spray because it runs. So you have to work with this in sections for real. Um... So as you when you spray it, you want to hurry up and blow dry that because your lace will lift up immediately. But right here you see me um blow drying it and getting it to um to melt. Um we back with the devil's breath. But we're just gonna go ahead and spray that on the lace and melt that down. So right here, I gotta work in sections. Um, <laughs> the devil's breath is kicking in. <laughs> uh, so we just melting that down, and I am. I keep going off camera, y'all. I was getting aggravated, and I was just trying to get this wig over and done with. But I um finally got my wig band, and we're gonna go ahead and tie this around our our lace, so we can go ahead and let that sit on there and melt. Y'all, excuse my armpits. I, I'm so sorry. But I end up getting them waxed the next morning. So, we just going to go ahead and tie this around her lace. It was giving me a hard time. So, I had to go off camera and try to tie it and so we can get it tied down. It was giving me a hard time. Like, hair was getting stuck in the look. I didn't even notice I was pulling hair. But, um... I I had to go, I had to go fix it because I was getting aggravated. I was just really finna end the whole video and be like, forget a YouTube video. But I couldn't leave my girls hanging because I need to keep pushing this content out for y'all. But we gonna go ahead and keep trying to fight with this wig band to get it tied so we can melt it. Y'all, I'm over here fighting. When I say fighting for my life, this wig band is... It's on me. <laughs> it, was, it was giving me a hard time. Um, so I'm still fighting with look at this hair just getting stuck. I really was just finna say forget it. Um, but yeah. So I'm gonna continue to sit here and fight with this wig band until I get it right. Like I didn't even realize I was holding the hair in my hand. 
no wonder why I couldn't get it out the wig band. But we finally getting around to tie this wig band around the back of our head because I can't see in the back. And I should have had somebody come tie this band on my head. So I'll be back when I get this wig tied and melted. And because it was too much for me, so I had to go style the wig off camera. So I'll be back when I style this wig. All right, y'all. So I'm finally back <laughs> and not fighting this wig and this wig band. But here I'm just brushing the wig out because y'all seen the whole video. I was fighting this wig, literally trying to get it together so that I can go ahead and get it styled for y'all. So I'm just brushing out the kinks um, in the wig because I literally have to beat myself up. Y'all, the dog is in the back. He's really getting on my nerves. I'd have been throwing stuff at the wall and everything. But now you just see me um, scooting the lace band up because it wasn't all, all the way on the lace. So I'm just scooting that up and getting ready to go ahead and start styling the wig. So I, sh I, I started putting everything up before i put the wig band on but that's why i'm taking so long because i'm plugging everything back up and i was really getting irritated girl why are you making faces at the camera like get it together i had to turn on me some music so i had to take me a little song break no the the high iron was it not on i would have burnt my lip if it was but um i'm plugging it up like i said i had plugged unplugged everything i was getting so frustrated so now I'm just waiting on the hot iron to go ahead and warm back up. Look at me sinking. <laughs> I had to get back into the spirits because why? I, I had to think, like, girl, why are you making a fool of yourself? So my hot iron, it heats up really, really fast. So I'm just, while it's heating up, I'm going ahead and put in some um, mousse on, my, on the top part of the wig so that I can go ahead and... Um, Lay the wig out, y'all. I'm sorry if y'all hear my dog in the background eating. She decides she wants to be hungry while um doing my voiceover. But, yeah, I'm just making sure everything is laid back and slayed. Fried, dyed, laid to the side. And that's what kids say. But, yeah, like, I be so heavy-handed with products. So, yeah, that's why it looks a hot mess. Girl, get it together, please. Um, so I'm just combing it through to ensure that everything is flat. Um, I really didn't have to part as much, but with me being so rough with the wig earlier, I kind of, you know, messed up my part. So you just see me fixing it, um, and just getting the part back straight. Um, uh, so yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and comb everything back down. Just make sure everything is in place so when I do use my um, hot iron, I can it'll just go like butter. So now I'm finna go ahead and, and go in. How did I forget to show y'all I was using a Nairobi mousse? Like, how did I forget to say that? Like, girl, get together. But now I'm going in with my hot iron. The light turned off, for real. Like, I just had so many difficulties in this video. But I'm just going in and um, flattening that out with my hot iron. And just making sure the wig remains flat. Um, and we just going to... I'm just... I just like for my wig to lay a certain way. Um, and you're going to see me to continue to fight with it. Because that's just what I do best. I fight till I finish. Um, but I'm just contemplating how I want it to fall. I know exactly how I want it to fall, but I'm just like still visioning the style in my head to see if it's going to go right. Um, So that's why you see me like really focused in this part because I don't want anything to go left. I really, I cannot afford for anything else to go left. Like everything was just going left this whole video. So like the look of aggravation, but <laughs> So I'm just starting over, just making sure it's just right the way I want it because I, I'm i just so over this week at this point. But I promise when y'all see the finish, result, you're going to be like, girl, you fought for a good reason. So I'm still just trying to get it how I want it. And 
it's just like I just gotta be patient and just concentrate. Um. So, yeah, I'm just I'm I was really ready to just snatch the wig back off, but I didn't. So <sighs> this is a long process, y'all. Kudos to y'all for even doing this by yourself, but I did it. <laughs> I did it, but I'll be back when um I start styling it. But wait, I forgot. I gotta use my stick. I'm using the 24 hour edge tamer wax stick, and this is the smell the scent um kiwi pineapple. I had to smell it because it smells so good. But I'm just using that to um lay down the top part of the wig. This is gonna ensure that your wig is super duper 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 flat at the top. So I'm just applying a little bit um at the top of the wig. Um and I'm gonna go back in with my hot iron and making sure that everything is flat. And I'll be back when I um style my wig. Y'all it turned out so pretty. Like look at it. I ended up cutting some layers in it and just pressing it out. But it is so pretty and I just want to say thank y'all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. And after this clip, you're going to see a picture. Thanks for watching. Bye. Y'all, this is the finished result. Like, look at it. It's so pretty. I ended up cutting some layers and pressing it out, and it turned out so pretty. But, yeah, thank y'all for sticking in this video with me, and I just want to say thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!